Ooh. Um. I don't know. I don't know who messes up the most lines. Everybody messes up lines. Everybody. Who messes up the most lines? <laughs> I'm not even gonna try to um, put, get anyone in trouble. I'm just gonna say I mess up the most lines. Um, I'm gonna say I mess up the most lines. I guess I'll, we all do. So I'm not gonna try to point anybody out. So I mess up the most lines. Uh, well, since uh, most of my scenes were uh, with uh, Shandia and myself, I would have to say no one. Cause we were both so, so good. <laughs> me. <laughs> okay, so James is not gonna admit to this, but it's definitely me. Uh, I think I haven't been around many of her scenes, but I think Chandia might be the one to mess up the most lines or improvise on the lines that she already has. Every time I get to set, he's so ready. He's so professional. He's such a great actor to work with. But whenever I get there, like I'm the one that's messing up. So, yeah, it's me. But I'm not around when we shoot, but it's not a matter of messing up the lines, but sometimes, shimmer, I'm not even gonna explain. Ooh. <laughs> uh, me. Um, <laughs> half the time, just because I'm so angry in character that I can't get the stuff right. Um, Probably Amy. <laughs> He's not been around, that's Amy. Yeah. But sometimes it goes, it goes great with her character. The flows just right in most of the time when she messes things up that you wouldn't even know. <laughs> I don't, mm, I don't, that, that might be me too, I'm not sure. It's a project that I think number one, you know, a lot of people who are part of the series pretty much understand that you know it's something that is real it's a real strong storyline it's, it's real strong there's a lot of uh, topics in the series that need to be talked about and aren't voiced mbk is important it's actually that's a funny question because i felt like me and the director were talking about this the other day um mbk is important because it tackles very serious issues and a lot of times people like to say oh why are you showing this because it's so serious and it's this it's so deep and you know people don't want to talk about serious issues and things like that but just because you don't want to talk about it doesn't mean that it doesn't happen so I think that my brother's keeper is showing that these things do happen and that we do need to talk about them in order for them to get solved. MBK is I mean as far as it goes for me, it's important to me for more than one reason. It's important because it's something that I feel that it's good for people to see. It's something that needs to be done, needs to be shown, and on that level, like everyone needs to see something of this caliber on TV, on in their DVD player, however it may get to them, whatever venue we use. But to me, I mean, like I said, I've never done anything on film before. Everything's been like theater, so. It's nice to be able to reach a broader audience, and then also every issue that we've tackled, I haven't even seen in my day-to-day -day life. So as a college student, it's nice to know that there are bigger challenges out there. It kind of helps you stay grounded when like, you think you're having the worst day ever, and then you come and read a script and you're like, hey, such and such is AIDS. <laughs> you're like, damn, you know, real life kicks back in. I think people should watch the show because it's real. This is real life. Everything that we've done in MBK happens every day around the world. So people are always talking about how they love reality TV. This is true reality TV. And I think it has a positive message in the end. And I think if you watch it, you learn something. I want people to know that it's real. It's a lot of passion and a lot of hard work has gone into this project. And I think people should watch it because it's just something for everybody. But what I like about MBK is we're responsible and we get our message across, but in a fashion that is acceptable to young audiences. And I think there's nothing like it. You need to watch it and you need to see it. And I just think that's why. Um, I think it's educational. It'll give people something to talk about in their homes. It'll open doors for kids that may be keeping um, secret paths or hiding what they do. It may give them a way to talk about it to their family or friends.
people should watch and be gay because um, you know there's something different you know people should watch MBK because I can tell you one thing there's not anything on TV like this there's nothing like it and I mean we sit around sometimes and flip through channels and we tune into TV eyed we've tuned into many different shows and there's nothing like this I guarantee on television right now that's why they should watch this show is important because it's unlike a lot of other shows on on television. I believe that that is extremely deliberate. No other television show is going to give you as much sex, <laughs> as much controversy, as much as much heart and soul. There are a lot of issues that a lot of people have steered away from so many times as far as homosexuality, infidelity, a lot of infidelity. You know, the 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 deceit the cheating, and I think that these issues are, are really a part of everyday life and they need to be depicted somewhere because everybody's not good and the bad people need to see themselves on TV too.